Good morning, I'm Kalina Estrinos and right now in your 13 Action News update, there are now more than 1,200 cases of COVID-19 in our state. More than 900 of those cases are right here in Clark County. 32 people have now died across the state. The majority of positive cases are among those ages between 30 and 59. Now this morning we're learning one person who has tested positive works at the Southern Nevada Health District. The temporary homeless shelter at Cashman Field will be closing this morning. More than 500 homeless people use the shelter during the first four nights. Everyone currently using the shelter can now head over to Catholic Charities, which reopened yesterday. And starting Monday, the county says new temporary isolation quarantine shelter will be opening up at Cashman Field. The city of Las Vegas will now let some businesses deliver alcohol, and it's only available through direct delivery by an employee, not a food delivery app, and you also have to order food along with that uh, request. Now, businesses that have already have an alcohol permit must apply for an alcohol delivery permit, which will last for about 30 days, but can be renewed throughout the duration of the shutdown. Our weather is still going to be a bit on the breezy side. Those winds coming in from the north, and that'll make it feel cool. We're in the 50s and 60s this morning. Lots of sunshine, and the winds tapered this afternoon when temperatures should hit the low 70s, forecasting 72 today here in Las Vegas. Calm and 74 on Friday. Clean of the wind kicks back up this weekend, but we're in the 70s. Next week, 60s and rain chances looking increasingly likely as we get through next week. All right, Justin, thank you. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktmv.com and our free mobile app.